Tonight, we are gonna be taking a 15 hour night bus from Mumbai all the way to Goa. We're okay? We're on the bus. Devin and I have noticed that people don't really sleep here. Once we're in Goa, we gotta find a way to get to our accommodations in South Goa. Which we have no easy. idea how we're gonna do that. We've been spit out onto the streets. We screwed up. We didn't book a train in time. Trains were supposed to be booked out a month. If you wanna take a train from Mumbai to Goa, tip, book it months in advance. That's right. That's why we're taking a bus. Woo! So this is what you can expect if you're grabbing a night bus. Whether you want to or you have to. From Mumbai to Goa. Let's go. We're Keith and Deb, and if you're new here, we have been traveling for the last two years. We just arrived three days ago, and tonight we will be taking our first night bus in India. Subscribe to follow along. Our first rickshaw in India. Actually really quite simple. You can order rickshaws on Uber. Um, and they're pretty cheap and they're good value. So that's what we did. I do not want to be a driver here. It is absolute chaos, especially this intersection. We were here earlier today for the coffee shop. It's nuts. People are swarming through the traffic trying to make it through. And we're inches away from this car, that car, these people. Another reason why backpack travel is so great. We fit everything with us on this seat. By the way, it may look like we have more stuff than normal, and that is because we put our, for the bus bag, and then our night bag, if this one has to go below, so we have all of our night stuff here. So this is where we wait for like uh, another half hour at this travel stand. I'd rather be early than late. Yeah, that's fine. Mumbai's been nice and we haven't been here that long, but I'm looking forward to already the more peace part of India, maybe in Goa, in Kerala that we're gonna see next. But I know it's India, so it's gonna be busy overall. But it's not as bad as I thought. I have to say, we said that in our Mumbai video, it's not as, as chaotic as we thought it would be. But still, there's a lot going on. Also, we booked our bus through One Two Go Asia, and there's actually a link below. If you need to book any buses literally in Asia, we'd love if you could use our link, but also, it wasn't that complicated and you could pick your pickup and drop off location, so make sure you check those out. So this one was actually pretty close to our hostel, which was really nice. We just found out that we actually have to go to the highway to catch our bus, so good thing we found that out before our bus got here. So we're gonna we gotta make sure we're waiting there. Hey, there's a bus there. Is that our bus? No. Oh. Watch the bike. How do we get over there? Just like the trains, you can book the different types, different tiered buses, just like AC bus or luxury or sleeper, basic economy. I think we picked a good one, hopefully. Big sort of middle of the road, inner city AC bus. Good thing we're carrying on only because we're small. Uh, but yeah, we actually have good blankets. You think they're clean? Um, well, yeah, they're fine. Sweet. And uh, we have a rack here for stuff, and we have curtains. Uh, there's a window, and it's actually way smoother so far. I don't think it's knock on wood. There's good AC, so we're gonna get we're gonna need these blankets. And there's plugs. We but need them. we'll show you in our bag tour later what we actually bring um, on the bus when we don't have our carry-ons with us. 
there's a light. I'm actually way more impressed with this than I thought. I'm also, honestly, I'm always happy when we can keep all of our stuff yeah, like this. Yeah, so it's really nice. I'm happy about that. We're gonna get organized and then get settled. We have and movies movie. downloaded, we have some snacks. It's gonna be 15 hours on this thing. By the end of it, we're probably gonna be like, well, get me off this. But it's a double bed. It's actually like, this we, is not bad. This bed. is kind of cute. Yay. Not your average Valentine's Day date night? No. <laughs> <laughs> We just met Ajay, who is the captain of this bus, and he brought us water and he just explained to us and he's super kind, so we wanted to introduce him. Thank you, Ajay. Thank Welcome you so much. much. Welcome to <laughs> hey, we made it. On the bus. Nice. We're gonna start a timer at 15 minutes because we've already been on here chatting with our friend, so starting now. Yeah, the captain of, of, of the, the bus was so nice to us and he accepted our ticket. We don't have a Indian phone number, so we couldn't confirm it with the text. He tried calling us, letting us know that it was late, like 20 minutes late. But we don't have an Indian phone, so that didn't work. It was really nice. Show us there's a bathroom in the back, with the lock. So we'll give you a tour of that later. Yeah, lovely. Really nice. So in our bus bag, now we didn't really need it this time because our carry-ons are with us. Um, I have important things because, well, we would be separated from our stuff right now. Also, it's really cold. So, that being said, my towel um, can be used as a blanket, which is pretty good. We won't need it this time because there's a blanket here. Maybe though. Now, you also want to bring your valuables with you. For me, it's like GoPro, drone, laptop. I actually put my laptop back away. Make sure they're with you. That's sort of a given, I guess. Unless you don't mind, but for us it makes us anxious a bit. Down jacket just in case. I swear to God, our our bus we took in Vietnam was the coldest it was in the entire country. It was it must have been 17 degrees in that thing. It was the, like the, the flying coffin, frozen coffin too. Anyway, so you definitely have down just in case. And then maybe like mouthwash or gum or your toothbrush, and then deodorant, uh, your wallet, and toilet paper is a major one. Because you're going to need this later for the bathroom, that's for sure. Actually, the bathroom is just for number ones here. Um, lip yeah. balm, because your lips get dried out. Airpods, deodorant, and bug spray. If you looked at our previous night buses in Cambodia, um, it, was in Laos. it was in Laos. Laos. There was there were mosquitoes in our, in our bus, so make sure you have some of that just in case, and then go. And water. Oh, I showed you uh, the warm clothes. Well, I'm wearing my pants already. And then my sweater was the other thing. Which is my long sleeve. <laughs> I forgot two items that are really important actually. A buff or like some sort of like scarf to cover your eyes and your ears. Ears because of maybe the cold air, but eyes mainly because of the lights and stuff in case. And then earplugs because it can get noisy. Also, my bag's pretty similar to Keith's in terms of what I bring when I come on a night bus if we don't have our big backpacks. But I also have um, like our, I carry our passports, I have like um, hard drive, more computer stuff, and then I also carry some medicine for us. So for example, both ginger gravel, which is good if you're feeling nauseous, and then normal gravel, which is good if you wanna go to sleep. So I have both of those things, as well as like a mini medical kit in case we need anything. Yeah, and then the same stuff Keith had. That was our train. No, it wasn't, it was a commuter train. <laughs> And now for the next little bit, we can enjoy a movie. Just chill out. I got my sweater, we got a blanket on. It's actually quite cozy. All right, I'm doing the bathroom tour. Here we go. Thank you so much. It's comfortable for you? Yeah, perfect. Okay, so this is the space. We have an actual toilet and a sink. And I think we're stopped right now, so it's good to pee. I have to say the floor's wet, which is to be expected. Um, but you know what? Bring your own toilet paper, wipe the seat down, um, just, you know, don't bring your shoes in your bed. And it's good. It's not, you know what, I'm gonna pee right now really quick. Toilet flushes too, so that's good. Honestly, it's not awful. Except for the wet floor and the fact that this door doesn't close. Um, it's still pretty good. That door doesn't, that door doesn't close, but there's a door here. So, you're still closed off. 
There's a bench right outside the bathroom. <laughs> I'm looking at the back window. All right, there we go. So we watched a movie, that was fun. Went to the front of the bus and the chauffeur and the other driver and the, uh, the captain wanted me to film the front and stuff and it's nice, cool vibes. Yeah, it's so sweet. They're, everybody's been Everyone's so Everyone's really friendly. nice. Yeah. yeah. It's been really nice. The bus is cruising along. Um, it's about midnight, so we've been on the bus for a few hours now, for sure. We still have so far to go. Everything's a big city though. Can you see this? Oh, it's our break. We were asleep. Kevin and I fell asleep. We made it. We made it. It's 1.18 in the morning. I don't know about you, I'm not really feeling hungry, but I did see bananas. So we're gonna buy some for tomorrow. It's bananas. And this is good. Bananas. Got them. It's like really busy out here. People are yelling at you. They come in. Come, come. Right. Too much. Right, <laughs> Too much in the middle of the night. Good morning. How's it going? It's 7.30. People are still sleeping and stuff, so we'll whisper. Um, it's sleep, but I have to say, like, it, like one o'clock. Right after, right after our break, we are trying to sleep. We hit the roads that were like really windy, like this, like in the mountains. So we're rocking back and forth. So we had to sleep on our backs and we rock back and forth. It was fine, like babies. I slept great. I slept well. Just slept well, but like, can't sleep on your side. It's like, you get swung out. I enjoyed it, especially bad. Yeah, Devin's the best sleep she had. She's, she hasn't had a good sleep yet. The views have been really nice this morning. We're almost there. Looks like we're really close to go up. We're almost there. We still have a couple hours. But we've made a lot of progress though. It was last night. Try to get ready beforehand. We're getting off soon. Okay. Eating a banana for breakfast. I can like, I haven't really been hungry. I've actually slept a lot this trip, which has been really nice. Here we go. That's pretty fine. I think we're pretty much all set to hop off the bus and be in the middle of nowhere. But no, that was, I don't feel out of it because that was like a night. Yeah, like yeah I, actually. That's the best I've ever slept on a night bus. That was a really good night bus. I'm actually so impressed. That was my best night bus thing we ever had. Ever. All right, this is us. Banaji, last stop. Put our shoes on. Off we go. I'm just getting thrown out into nowhere. Okay, off we go. Thank you, bus. And just like that, we've been spit out onto the streets. <laughs> and it's hot, so I'm happy I took my pants off and my shirt off. 
it's it was freezing in there. What bus to take, so yeah, nice. so there's a bus stop right here, and we're gonna try to figure this out. Look, a bus stop. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna sneeze. We're in a random bus stop. We gotta catch two buses, I think, and then maybe a, a, a rickshaw in order to make it to our hostel. <laughs> it's gonna be an adventure. <laughs> I think you can just grab a taxi if you want, but it's quite expensive. And we're gonna try taking the bus. There's no goes. Ubers here, by the way. Uh, but yeah, well, let's figure this out. We've already had two people help us out. We need a third. From what I understand so far, we have to go to Margao and then to Cancona, and then we take a rickshaw. And for both? Yeah. I don't know how many people we've had help us, but people in line have, have helped us. Everyone's so nice. Yeah, like we've been, yeah, it's just funny. So I think it's this bus right here for our first stop. I actually don't feel tired for a night bus. I feel like I literally got the best sleep I've had since we've been in India. I feel rejuvenated, guys. That was an amazing night bus. Also, just so you know, Google Maps does a really good job showing you public transport itineraries, just like any other city, any other place in the world. Looks like we'll actually be able to walk, I think, if we can do this properly. So, you have that, huh? Holofly, by the way, that's the data plan we use. You can use our link, by the way, it helps us support our channel. But if you have data, then you, you're good. Well, we actually met some friends here. They're going to the same place as us. Um, our bus stop is Golem. Golem. We did it. Woo. It's definitely a lot warmer in Goa right off the bat. That there we are. That was a long bus, but I, I have to say the music and the vibe, like it was a cool experience. <laughs> Okay, Be careful on the edge. let's go. And there you go. We, we did it. it. We survived our Woo. night bus. Timer, I'm stopping it right now. 18 hours and seven minutes. Oof, long. <laughs> but you know what? It was actually really smooth. We were just talking about this. Yeah. It went by like quickly. We by... slept well. The driving was good. The actual night bus was The best awesome. we've had. Yeah, and then it was just because where our hostel is in Goa is further, it's in South Goa, South and Goa. the bus dropped us off in North Goa, so that's So we had we to take. trickle our way down, but yeah. that was cool. Honestly, it was a cool experience. Made some friends on the bus, too. Uh, oh, they bought, they bought our ticket, by yeah, the way, so thank you very much. Was they bought our so ticket. was so sweet of them. We were like, no, we'll pay. And they're like, no, no, no. And Anyhow, um, we missed the train, but that's okay. Yeah. The bus was good. It was not bad at all. Great so way to get down. We'll see you in our next video when we explore this area, South Goa. Thanks for watching. See you soon. We want to take your bag off. I have a more on that, thank you. Oh, there's a bunch of bats in that tree. Sketchy. Luxury with AC trains. Buses we though, you mean. Oh. While you're on the train and you sit here and lounge. The bus, you keep saying train. 